Hey everyone, this is Grace of GB Maltese and I did a little unboxing from some paintings I received from New Frog that they sent to me and I thought I would show you how to do diamond painting with just the things that come in the kit. You don't have to have a lot of fancy equipment. You just need to have your diamonds your kit because this is how you're going to pick your diamonds up is with this wax and there's a piece of paper you peel it back and I usually push it in there a couple of times to get my pen filled with some wax now the one thing that I do like about these clear covers is I have picked up number one and I can look on here for number one and I can do all the number ones because I can see them through the plastic so I'm going to show you brought some scissors I'm just gonna cut that off and here's my tray I'm gonna pour some into my tray So you don't have to put them into baggies. I normally do, and I'll show you how I do that in just a moment. Let me pull my paper up, and I'm going to find. Normally, I use a light board because it's just easier for me to see. But I'm going to show you, if you don't have a light board, and you don't want to buy one until you're sure if you like it or not, you can just go through. Okay, you're going to pick them up. The flat side is to the bottom because that's what's going to stick to your canvas. And I'm looking for the number one, and there it is. Pick up another one, find number one, and there's one right there. That's all there is to diamond painting. Very, very easy. Pick it up. You only want to pick the ones that has the round side sticking up. This kit, as I said, comes from New Frog. Very easy to use. The diamonds are very pretty and shiny. Not sure how well it's picking up on the camera, but they are very pretty. So I'm just going to go through and do the number ones. That's how I did another kit I did. I went through and just picked a color. And since I had the plastic, I could see through and find them and I just went through and when I got done with one area I could put the paper down and go to another thing okay so if you've never tried diamond painting it's very easy and I think it's to me it is so relaxing I enjoy it so much it gives me a chance to kind of Take a breather and relax, not having to really think about anything. For some reason, this craft just seems to make me or help me unwind. And I've heard many, many people say that, that started doing this. They said, it, it's hard to explain. I, I mean, there are other crafts that are that way. I also enjoy doing mine other things that I like but this is really one of the best that I've done and have really enjoyed very simple just going through and as you can see I don't have anything fancy I'm just using what came right in the kit I'll go through and do the number ones if you have any questions about anything um, about what I'm doing or other things that you might want to get to help you with your diamond painting just be, feel free to ask below I'm here to answer questions if you have any it's just as simple as this go through and put the diamonds down the package had the number one on it I look over here 
to my legend and number one is number one. You have to look at the legend because the package, even though it has one, the picture might have been something different. There might have been a star there instead. But this one had the number one and it had the color. So that makes it very easy. One thing I do like about these new frog paintings is that these symbols are very recognizable for us. They have numbers and they have letters and it's very easy. Now let me show you what I do for a lot of mine. I will kit the, <clears throat> this in a different way. So when I'm done and I don't want to do any more, <clears throat> excuse me, I can't really put them back into this little bag. So you can buy baggies. Very, very inexpensive. You can find them at Walmart on Amazon. And what I'll do, just open this up. And this is number one. So I'm going to, I bought these stickers. You can get these at Walmart, Amazon, just, just about anywhere. And I'm just going to put this sticker here. And the baggie had the one on it, so I'm going to put a number one on the baggie. And when I look at the symbol here, it was a number one. So I'm just going to put the number one again because that is the code. If I want, I can put the DMC number on there, but I'm not going to do that at this point. I'm going to go ahead and empty the rest of these diamonds into my tray. It's not a lot for this color. And that way, when I'm finished doing the one, number ones, I can just put them in this baggie. You can get smaller ones. The kit comes with a few baggies, but it's not enough if you wanted to bag up all 19 of them. So it's very simple to get baggies. And you just pick up number one. Okay, let's find number two. All right, here's my number two. Just cut that off. I'm going to get another baggie. And put it out. Like I said, you don't have to do this. You could go through and find all of your number twos and put them down. And I'll put some of the number twos down to show you. Here are my number twos. This is very easy. It's just so relaxing because there's not a lot of preparation and making big messes. You can take this with you somewhere. Okay, these are number twos. So, well, I can't do it without my pen and it fell on the floor. So, let me get that. Okay, um, if you get to the point that it's not sticking to your pen any longer, if you can't pick up any of the diamonds, that just means you need to put some more wax on it, so you'll just dip it back into your wax. Okay, let's find some number twos. There's a number two there. There's a number two over here. Here's number two. And you just go through and you put them on. It's so easy. And you say, oh! Oh, oh no, I put it in the wrong place. You can use tweezers. I just use my fingers. Pick it up. Take it off. You can use tweezers. You can use whatever, but I usually just pick them off with my fingernails because it's very simple. So I'll do just a few more and we'll see how it looks. Okay, here's some more number twos. The rounds are very easy. You don't have to worry about getting a square into a square. You just put them on down. Very relaxing. As you can see. Just looking for the numbers. There's two. Very easy. 
I really like, like I said, I like the way New Frog has numbers and letters. It makes it very easy to do. Now, if I decide, oh, okay, I'm done for today, I would just cover this up. You always cover this when you're finished. You don't want to leave the sticky side up because something could fall on here and it would stick. If you get paper stuck on here, it doesn't come off. You have to kind of wash it off. Um, I've used wet rags, um, Clorox wipes, but then it loses the sticky. And I have things that I can use to, to, to fix it, but I just try to be very careful. Um, I've done some other videos on showing that type of thing, but it's just... It's just very easy to be careful with it. Let me do one more of these into the baggie so that I don't forget what I'm doing. And I'm going to look at my legend over here. And it tells me number two is number two. So I'm going to put a number two. And I'm going to put a number two. And I'm going to circle it. I'm going to circle the other one also. That's just letting me know that that's the circle number. These are rounds on here. So I hope that helps you just a little bit. If you have questions or want me to show some more, I will do that. Um, I would appreciate you subscribing to my channel if you would like to learn more. I do different types of things. Click the bell to see when I have something new out. Let's take a real quick look at just the very few that I put on there. There's not very many, but let me see. I'm showing them. There you can see just a little bit. And I might do work on this one with a paint with me, a drill with me or whatever, and chat with you guys. So just wanted to show you in case you were wondering and you're just beginning diamond painting. Do you need a whole bunch of stuff? No, you do not. So just start. Have fun with it. See if you like it. Then you can start adding more things if you like. The um, process is very simple. Anyway, that's all I have for today. You guys have a blessed day. Take care. Love you. Bye.